it's a Gibraltar player, they just get all numbers behind yeah. the ball, you know, and they just try to, you know, stop the space, playing into the areas where you want to. You know, closing down the spaces in there, you need a bit more movement. Oh, and Doherty, there is movement now. Matt Doherty, good cross! Evan Ferguson, Ireland lead in Faro in the eighth minute. Best chance they've created, first chance they created. And they have the lead, and that should settle the nerves. There is a VAR check on this, though, and I'm not sure what that's about. Well, it may be if Doherty is offside, but what a lovely ball, wasn't it, from Ogbeni? Just see when he comes in field. He just waits, and he waits, and he's waiting for the run. And there it is. You clearly see he's onside, there's yeah. no problem with that. And he played into a good area to the edge of the six yard box, and Cipollino was picking up Ferguson, just couldn't get close enough to him. And the movement from Ferguson was excellent. Should be fine. And that should be the opening goal of the game. And that should settle things down. Same deal from Manning. Little flick on it, looking for the slightest of touches. Oh, ho, ho. Duffy's been busy in the last while. Well, where's the marking? No one was picking him up at the back, but he just couldn't sort his feet out no. quickly enough. You can see how disappointed he is. Because it was a fabulous ball whipped in here from Manning. It caused all sorts of problems. Forget three at the back, five at the back. It's just everybody back in a big line. Johnston wriggles away from the cover. Johnston got the shot on target. And that seemed to move a little bit. Coaling, palming it away. Lovely play, though, wasn't it, from Johnston over that left-hand side. Natural right footer came in field. Never going to pass up the opportunity to get the strike a goal. Keeper probably made a little bit more. Cullen. Now Doherty makes a good run. Ogbene through to Matt Doherty. He's got in behind. Chance. Goal. Mikey Johnston at the second attempt. It came back off the post. 2-0 Ireland. Again, we're going to have a VAR check. And I'd say it's that run again from Doherty, which they're going to look at. But it's exactly how the first game, yes. the first goal came about, wasn't it? With that little interchange of play between Ogbeni and Doherty. Once again, look, look at the run, no one picking up, look at the space he's in. I think he can clearly see he's on site, as was Johnston, yeah. who got in front of his marker, Sergeant. Lovely ball in. I mean, he'd done well to react to the ball that came off the post, but there's Doherty with the pass. He was unlucky with the first attempt, but yeah. the second attempt just put it over the line to double the lead for Ireland. Carbon in behind the back line. Ogbeni's cross, calling at full stretch, it's come out to Jason Knight. Took a touch and Colin puts it out for a corner. This is the ninth corner of the game, all Ireland. Uh, not convincing of the goalkeeper, there wasn't from the initial ball no. that came in here. Which you collect, Out swinging corner again from Johnston. Duffy! Whoa! Well, he just let that meet his boot. Yeah, Could have scored in the first half. Yeah, he wasn't far away and the marking wasn't particularly good. Like you see, Cipollina was close. Ryan Manning. Johnston. Again, just pushes the ball forward. There's a great ball in. Oh, another brilliant run from Jason Knight. And just why? Yeah, I just wonder if he was offside. Was he offside when the ball was played? No, he certainly was. And he's time to take taking effect. players on, creating chances. This corner could affect the game in a huge way. Oh, and there's Doherty 3 0. How did he manage to finish that to the back of the net? Just pure determination. Second goal for his country. Was that Jamie McGrath with a flick? Whoever got the flick at the near post, I tell you what, that was quite magnificent. Doherty did done well at the far post, but just watch when the ball was delivered in here. Watch this for a flick. Oh, my Absolutely word. Absolutely outstanding. And you can see Doherty was so strong at the back post with his marker. But look at that from McGrath. That is absolutely brilliant. I think it was Bozo who was picking up Doherty. <laughs> and it was a great finish. The, the VAR Observe. officials are being consistent because there's a, a check on it now. But they should check every, I was going to check I know. Every. Malumbi. Of Benny. That's nice. Eda. The shot. And Malumbi has another go at it. McGrath. It's on target from Jamie McGrath. And that's belted into the side netting. Well, Malumbi's not too happy with McGrath. I think he took it off his foot. I think he'd every right to hit, take the strike on. There's a little ball in. Eda actually came off his thigh. Initial strike came in from Malumbi. He's trying to work him, I think. I wouldn't mind being 42 again, though. Now, here we go with Jamie McGrath. Good cross. There's the goal. Callum Robinson was a goal-scoring machine for Stephen Kenny earlier on in the campaign. And he's back in the goals again. 4 0 with just over 10 minutes to go. Well, um, the goal check's up again. Ah, not, they're just doing that to stay involved. <laughs> well, we'll see if he was in okay. an outside position or not, but lovely <laughs> ball in. I've been usually impressed with Jamie McGrath as well this evening. I think he's been excellent. Holding his width over this left hand side. Comes off Cipollina to him. 
But what about this from across? Oh, oh no, he's you in know, trouble. Yeah, yeah you can, I can yeah. stop writing now. This will be. That's the same the time. You know, yes. you keep getting a wee yeah. niggly free kicks. Oh there no, there's the full time whistle. Stephen Kenny's team came to Faro and they've done what they had to do. They've done what they expected to do. Second victory of the campaign. 4 0. It's finished here for Ireland in Faro.